I was Prince Harry's flight attendant. He gave me a gift. Welcome to Royal Family Lud, my channel. Recently, Prince Harry traveled from the United Kingdom to California, making one flight attendant feel incredibly special. The 38-year-old Duke of Sussex was returning to London to give a deposition in the well-publicized celebrity phone hacking lawsuit against Mirror Group newspapers. But on the flight back to his present residence in Montecito, California, Harry reportedly gave a flight attendant who goes by the online identity Holden Pattern a gift fit for the sky. Harry offered Pattern a free copy of this shocking autobiography. Spare. Thank you. Please subscribe to my channel. According to reports, Pattern recently posted on social media about meeting Harry on their American Airlines journey. The book was discovered by the steward in my luggage that a passenger gave to me. Harry only spent three days in England to take part in the trial before flying back to California on Thursday. During the brief vacation, he purportedly remained at Frogmore Cottage, his former residence, but he avoided meeting any royals, neither his father King Charles nor his brother Prince William. After their 2018 nuptials, Harry and his wife Meghan Markle lived at Frogmore. The couple moved to California, but the King, 74, formally kicked them out early this year. Around the time Spare reached the stores in January, Charles started preparing for the eviction process. Prince Andrew, the king's disgraced brother, will receive the cottage in exchange for leaving the Royal Lodge in Windsor, which is where he currently resides. Since the early 2000s, the Duke of York, 63, and his ex-wife Sarah Ferguson have shared the $37 million home. Despite Charles' best efforts since April, Andrew is currently refusing to budge from his 30-room mansion. The decision as to whether or whether Andrew leaves the house, however, does not truly rest with the former Prince of Wales. Andrew may also be compelled to leave the area by the UK's Chancellor of the Exchequer. The chief finance minister in the parliament is in charge of deciding how much money the government will spend and how much it will tax. Regarding Harry's autobiography, the 400-page Tom delves deeply into his strained relationships with William, Forty, and Charles, as well as the feelings he experienced following the death of his mother, Princess Diana, in 1997. In addition, Harry addressed the controversy over his 2005 Nazi outfit, referred to the Duke of Cambridge as his arch-nemesis, and asserted that William had once physically assaulted him during a dispute about Markle 41. Publisher Penguin Random House reportedly paid Harry $20 million, and it's possible that he may soon sell the picture rights to his novel.